Hi, I'm Elizabeth. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So do you ship Joe and Lori from Little Woman? If you do, this is the place for you today and this is the guilty pleasure meant for you. Let's talk about it. Personally, I've been shipping Joe and Lori since I first read Little Woman by Louisa May Alcott, of course, as a child, and twice more since Greta Gerwig movie adaptation of Little Woman. Jo was an independent female character and I always appreciated and respected that. So I could have understood if Jo decided to not get married and go on with her career, as in our society it's perfectly fine that not every woman wants to get married and or start a family. But that was not what happened in Little Woman. What I could not forgive Alcott for is denying us Joe and Lori only to make her marry a professor twice her age. And most of all, I will never ever forgive Alcott for having Lori marry someone like Amy, who is to me the embodiment of those people who get more than they deserve in life for no reason at all. So if you feel like I feel, I'll let you know that this book is the answer. It is a guilty pleasure for those who felt gutted by how the original storyline ended. It is a retelling where the authors give us the pairing we always wanted. Joe and Lori have a unique bond on an intellectual level and not only intellectual. Uh, and thanks to the authors of Joe and Lori, we got the alternative ending that puts our minds to rest. The story takes place between the two original books, Little Woman and Good Wives, in which Jo has successfully published her first book and struggles to write her second. Lori takes Jo to New York under the impression that he only wants to keep her mind off her work when he secretly plans to ask her to marry him. Jo's desire to remain independent leads her to turn down his heartfelt proposal over and over and over again, and Lori leaves heartbroken to start college. He returns with a fiancé approved by his uncle, but she breaks off the engagement after she witnesses how the best friends interact around each other. I mean, you just have to look at them to understand. Jo finally starting to realize that she made the biggest mistake of her life, wants to confess her love while telling Lori that she accepts his decision because she asked him to look for another girl to become his wife. So, I mean, she felt like she couldn't complain. So we finally reach the moment when they both are on the same page because she is ready to declare her love and he is free again and there is nothing stopping them from getting engaged, therefore reaching the conclusion that the two characters deserve, in my opinion, of course. So what else to add? Everyone needs a spoonful of sugar every now and then. Uh, so if you ship Joe and Lori, definitely, definitely check this out. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.